everybody. It's Constance Reese with Black Tree TV, and we are here at the Haunted House movie premiere. That's right, we've got Marlon, we've got Sean, we've got all kind of Wayans, Wayans for days, so we are so excited to get all of these fantastic interviews. Stay tuned. What's up, Black Tree TV? What's going on? How's it popping? What's popping? What's, what's going on? <laughs> what are you looking forward to the most in seeing a, a haunted house? Because oh, I've already seen it. Oh, you already, you've already seen it. So what should we look forward to? Laughs. Yeah. Crazy, uh, out there, Wayne's family style humor. Yeah. In your face. I write just so that my actor can act, and I produce to make sure he's acting in some good stuff. Okay, and what, what did you bring to this this film that you feel like so much different and that people need to see? All of it. All of me, unfiltered. Me making the decisions going that's going too far or not going too far. And I don't have no fil no gauge or no filter. I don't know any better. Oh, okay. Something's wrong. When you see the movie, you're going to be like, something's wrong. Do you have a fear yourself of, of ghosts? Um, I do, actually. I, I, I mean, I, th I have a healthy respect. You know, I have a healthy respect. If sometimes, if I feel like there's one around, I'm very polite. I ha I'm well mannered, and I try not to offend it. So, do you feel it? Like, do you feel that there's things when I feel like there's some something that isn't that I can't see? So I just try to be, like I said, I just try and be nice. So in the film, you play a psychic slash exorcist, right? Yes. Yes. So do you feel like you have any of those skills yourself where you can really read people's minds, tell tell what they're thinking? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I definitely, Marlon, he gave me this role, and I think he transferred some powers to me, and uh, I'm pretty fired up about it. Yeah. Like, I can, I can sense that you're... You're undressing me right now. Yeah, you know, Marlon and I are friends, and he called me. He was like, man, I want you to play my, my thug cousin. And anytime me and Marlon get to put our brains together, it's always a great thing. You know, creatively, we, we're very similar. But, yeah, I'm the thug cousin that thinks he's going to come over there, settle some beef. You got beef with anybody, let me know. It's going down. And I find out it's a ghost. I'm like, hey, uh... My thuggery ain't really <laughs> on ghost level, so I'm going to holler at you. I will tell you the honest truth. I was surprised how great this thing came together because we improvised so much. I, I had no idea. I was like, what, is, what, what are they going to do? Because we just went and went and went and went and went. And many times I was thinking, how are they going to put this together? And then I saw it, and I was like, wow. Wow, it has been such an exciting night. I mean, Atheon, Crockett, talking to us. We had Molly, Wayne, not everybody cutting up. <laughs> That's how we do here at Black Tree TV, bringing you the absolute best in media. I'm Constance Reese, and until the next time, see you soon. It definitely was different um, in, the, in the fact that I got to, like, have a character that I could work on, and you could see him from the beginning to the end of the film.